I miss it. But with that being said, we are going to be jumping into game one of Zamba and Swagas uh, starting off on Pokemon Stadium 2. This feels like as soon as Yoshi gets that big down in, that big up in. Look oh. up. Up, up. It's been seven seconds, Suarez. Come on, man. Gets that reset with neutral. <laughs> tries to end it all with Florida. Oh, 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 look how big that egg is. Oh, my goodness. 117% in the first 15 seconds. Now it's Rob's turn to play the game. Yeah, but how long is he going to be able to play the game? Not long as Suarez, because only putting on 50, 40% onto the board. Going to have to win neutral a hell of a lot more times than Yoshi uh, to be able to make up for that damage. Let's see what we can do with this rage that Rob has, though. Uh, opportunity to get stage control, and now, uh, wow, chasing one another here. Oh, um, okay, I like that attempt from Suarez. He wanted to go for the Jago back here. Uh, just barely missed the first Jago, but he was able to close it up with a back here at the end of the day. <laughs> just double jumping out of up here, just keeps on double jumping out of pressure. As Rob, somebody with maybe not the best mobility, how do you actually challenge that? You, you don't. Yeah, Yoshi cheating all over the place. Now 61% <gasps> calling out that jump. Almost going to get it. Rob does like to go high. And uh, Sw Yoshi can just afford to use that mobility just to kind of like close the gap. Swoyu just being so patient at the ledge. Just going out a couple of eggs. But that is going to spell the end of his first stock. This match is already going so quickly. Has that jump call out, but not getting the spike hit. Oh, and these parries coming out, man. Uh, we're seeing them work against Zamba so much tonight. And now... We have another ledge trap scenario, but it's a little bit harder to ledge trap Rob. So uh, just these polar opposite matchups that we're seeing from Suarez get consistently. He went from Wii Fit Trainer to Hero to uh, Pichu and now Rob. And he's just like making all these adaptations in real time. Yeah, I mean, despite like the circumstances, he's just like doing so well. Uh, he's like playing every single possible kill to archetype across the board um, at this point. Oh, is he going to be able to find this tech Ooh, chase? Yeah. Yes, he is. Zama misses that initial tech onto the platform. Z uh, Swagger jumps above him and has enough time to be able to set that up. That was just amazing awareness and such a good follow-up. Yeah, and that's, uh, the, that's tangent that I went on about like Suarez specifically is just, again, the polar opposite that exists for Zamba where he's been in Losers Finals for a very long time just kind of waiting and watching Suarez play four back-to-back -back sets. And just Ooh. like that, wow. Now Zamba coming alive, warming up a little bit, and now we got a one-stop game. Yeah, you made that double jump, and then you can find the punish at some point. So really good catch on the landing from there Zamba. Yep. Keeps on catching these landings. Oh, Suarez oh, oh, holding oh. onto that double jump for daily life. Uses it to get back onto the stage this time around. No follow-up. Oh, boy. Oh, it, buddy. Wow, this is so even now. It was very solidly Suarez's favor. And now Zamba working his way back in. But Yoshi cheating <laughs> once more. <laughs> Anybody else, they would have died there. Only, only Yoshi could do those kinds of things, which I think is pretty funny. Um, oh, Swag is using that back hit oh, as the no. opportunity to get back on. Yes, I love that. Is Maybe? that death? <gasps> oh, Rob, just a little bit too oh, big. That, 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 that was so close. He was almost able to cover the opposite direction with Apu. That was so well played from Swagas. That time, retreating back to the ledge, using Egg as his opening, just resetting the situation. This is anybody's game. Honestly speaking, though, that looks like the optimal jab block punish. And, uh, honestly, on most characters, I think that would have been the game, but Rob a little yep. bit too big. And now, anyone's game here. Oh, <gasps> no way. Rob, you got some juice? The oh, Yoshi, juice. no jump. And still enough to be able to That's smack it. Swagas, and he drifts back down to the stage. No ability to be able to go cover properly. That was just good awareness from Zamba. <laughs> Suarez kind of kicking himself for that one, and Zamba just staying composed regardless, because he knew how easy that game was, able to just kind of potentially slip away. So Suarez has to take two in a row if he wants to go to Grand Finals, or Zamba can play for this rematch. The, the, so this is where Suarez made a mistake. He double jumped there. As soon as he lost that double jump, he had no ability to go anywhere where uh, Rob would be able to cover in time. As yeah. Yeah, exactly correct right there. Uh, at best, maybe an air dodge upwards, maybe, but the down smash is a multi-hit and maybe would have clipped Yoshi and put another situation. It is what it is. We have Zamba up 1-0 here. Tilde waiting in grand finals on the winner of the set. Yeah, I'm so surprised. This really seemed like it would be Suarez's game. His punish really seemed to be on point. It was actually all from that jab lock that didn't kill. Uh, and he had a good idea with his like multi-directional coverage, but Zamba was able to punish him in the end lag of that egg. But going immediately into game two, this time to small battlefield. Uh, but, you know, <laughs> very similar stage choice, but maybe just a little bit smaller. Yeah, we saw a zero to basically 100% damage output from Suarez in the game one, but still, Zamba was the one to able to take the game one, so if Zamba can play off of that, like, adaptation, we can potentially see a 2-0 victory here for Zamba. 
All right, he's a grab from uh, Zamba, just not getting touched yet. Wow, the polar opposite of the last game, despite being on the counter pick stage for Suarez. Yeah. Well, right now, Zamba going to be trying to set up a bit of an edge guard there, but just misspacing that Chara ends up shooting it off stage. Oh. Is going to catch Suarez's first option from the ledge. And now, from what it really seemed like, it would be Suarez's set. Zamba's sitting at a pretty confident lead for himself. Good jump call out, but no spike hitbox to be able to convert. Yeah, this is looking absolutely brutal here <gasps> for Suarez. Uh, an amazing first stock, and Rob can live a very yeah. long time, especially on the stage. Yeah, and Zamba's just like chilling, zoning all the way from center stage, just catching Suarez's next defensive options, just putting on all this chip damage and making this lead bigger and bigger for himself with each uh, projectile that he is going to be able to connect. Gets that drag down. Is that down there going to be able to do it? Not quite. This time goes through the same situation, and Zamba not landing aggressively, but double jumping out of there. No, I absolutely agree with you there, Ryan. This is looking kind of scary. Uh, for Suarez taking way too much damage, 100% and counting. Zamba still sitting on first stock. Oh, wow, just gonna get out of there. Amazing recognition from Zamba to people panic jump, people panic button out of shield, but goal is the only thing, well, one of the only things that you can do to disengage and be able to punish uh, Yoshi. Uh oh, here Big goes. punish. here we go. I like the little bit of egg there, but now yeah, the neutral air almost gonna get punished on a parry, but wow, the laser at 151% Zamba is sitting comfortable. Oh, Zamba was just not expecting such an aggressive landing uh, from Suarez. Gonna be able to find the egg, <gasps> catches the next button. Oh, but that neutral air is gonna be able to connect and it resets the situation for Zamba. Oh, what do we got here, man? We got Suarez clawing his way back in with a chance to get this next stock. All this rage on Yoshi. Uh, Rob's still a little bit too big to get the KO, but almost going to close that gap. Oh, wow, that what a choice. That delayed option out of shield would have been able to cover that spot dodge. It covered uh, Zamba sitting in shield, too. That was just such a smart option from Suarez, really keeping Zamba on his feet. Yeah, it looked like an attempt for a shield break. And wow, what a landing to the platform. Small Battlefield's lower platform is going to give him that benefit. That wow, the grab that break. That traded. Why did that trade? Oh, no. And just like that, Suarez going to be taken. He didn't die. He didn't die. That new trailer <laughs> didn't kill Yoshi at 190%. God bless. 211% uh, uh, Yoshi just hanging on forever. And the spacing on that recovery to get back to ledge. But that's going to be do it. Ooh. 220 plus. But Suarez made that second stock count so hard. 50% lead on Gob. That means you can set up tech chases. That means you can set up jab locks. That's going to be so, so cute. <laughs> there it is. Yeah, just that little oh bit of extra goodness, damage. Oh, my goodness. No. The commentator's curse is coming all over the place. Oh. Wow! That's a, that was so that covered the entire platform. Rob like extended his hitbox slightly. Oh, the patience. Suarez is kind of playing out of his body right now. Uh, oh. And I really hope I didn't just jinx it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Rob! Oh, here we go, though. This is looking very scary. I know Suarez is going to stay grounded here for just a moment, but just as I say that, I, I think you have to stay grounded in these high percent scenarios if you want to close it out in your favor. These eggs are just a menace for Zamba right now. And Zamba's playing just outside oh, of the range of that F tilt. Oh. Waits out the air dodge, but no up here in wait. time. Suarez had the right idea. Oh, oh buddy. But no way. 155, and now Rob hanging on for a very long time. Oh. That egg going to be shooting him back off onto the stage. Ellie Dodge is back onto the ledge. No punish on the neutral getup. This is so scary for both players because anybody is capable of taking this one. No way that missed. Okay. He That's jumps. crazy. 1-1. One, one. And honestly, from 0 to 100 in both games, but the person who initiates a 0 to 100 doesn't win the game. Damn. Swoggy just played out of his mind. He held on to that second sock so long. He was able to get so much <laughs> extra credit uh, out of it, and he was just, like, chilling. But they were swinging. They yeah. were both, like, so antsy in this position. Ooh, but one yeah. down tilt in the wrong direction. Zamba presumably pressing a second one because if we got down tilts once. Also, let, let, let's, let's, get a, let's get a replay on that one more time, actually. This one. I, I want to I I just really hone in on something that was so well played from that's just, it's just flirting with disaster though. Like at any moment, uh, rage, uh, rob, uh, up smash could have uh, came out. I need one more second to be able to get this done. He gets it, and there it is. Oh, he just, he, <laughs> I wanted to zoom in on his jump. I will. That's uh, all. All right, there it is. Uh, one to one here on PS2. Uh, I want to say, hmm, I, I can't remember what game one was on. Was it on the stage? 
It might have been. Yeah, yeah. It was on PS2. They switched to Small Battlefield and now back to Pokemon Stadium 2. Swagus has a good idea with the jump call out, but Zamba uh, going to be pressing neutral a little bit sooner um, and ends up getting his hitbox out there with the four Swagus. Well, yeah, get some juggle situations. And now Suarez is kind of in the corner, but that didn't stop him in the last game. It might not stop him now. Ooh, just up, he's back onto the stage. Swagus oh. sitting so patiently, finds that conversion. That's going to be big damage and oh. putting Zamba in a nasty position. Yeah, Zamba's got to land and he lands right into that command grab, holding shield right away. And now Suarez closing the distance and getting the lead. Uh, look, look how patiently Swagus is playing now. He has a bit of a lead for himself. He has no incentive to really go in on Zamba, but that time landing a little bit too aggressively onto Zamba's shield and puts himself into Kwangu as a result. Yeah, now we got a ledge trap scenario. This is where uh, uh, Suarez does happen to thrive. And now, landing pr improperly, but not going to get punished too hard for it. Whoa. Your up tilt up here has to be free and perfect because more often than not, it can catch almost everybody else's Y acceleration on the double jump. Oh, watch out. Wow, good time. That shield, shield was so smart. Instead of putting himself into a tech chase, well, that tech chase would have covered everything. Tech roll in, tech in place. <gasps> Oh, wow. Not going to get too much off of that. Another down air, though. This quick, meaty percent here for Suarez. Racking up this extra credit. Trying to book himself a ticket to Grand Finals until then. That was so well played. That was so beautifully played. Zamba jumped out there, made Suarez think that he was going to go for the immediate up here, and instead just threatened with his positioning, baited out double jump, and then chased him all the way down. That was just that was just so well played. Oh, but now just like that, Zamba coming alive and racking up a quick 41% trying to close this gap. And this is game three, losers finals. This is the final chance for one of these players to advance the grands. But uh, I don't know, Zamba definitely still has it in him to do this. Oh, for sure, they're able to get that up throw. Maybe tries to catch a preemptive double jump, and I really like that up here, actually. Suarez armoring right through the gyro, but for, for what credit, not too much, because Zamba keeps on putting on this pressure. Oh, I agree with you there. Uh, trying to throw this egg in their face, but uh, not going to get too much off of it. This next stock can actually set the tone for the rest of the set. Let's see who's going to answer first. <gasps> Landing oh, a little bit too aggressively no onto Zamba's shield with Rising Ariel. He needed to get there a little bit sooner. <gasps> oh, no way! These powerful moves coming out from both players, but it's Suarez pulling the trigger first. But no, did he burn his jump? Ah, uh, but he still has an air dodge. Oh no, still seems to oh, have it on deck. <gasps> no! no. Last stock, game three, losers finals. One player is going to advance the grand finals, and I don't know who it's going to be. That's a gob Jago in hand, sitting at the oh. edge of the stage. That is a gob up to no good. So Zamba is probably oh, going to no. be looking for a little something funny. Oh no. Uh, 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 Yoshi just wants to land oh. and taking 50% oh. in the process. <laughs> he just jumps out of everything. That looks that looks so tough for Zamba. He just wants his damage. Let the boy have his damage. Oh. Finally finds that jump in. Not going to be able to set up Here a tech chase a little bit go. too close to the edge of the stage. Oh, trying to get the tech chase scenario. <gasps> Suarez is thriving right now. Oh, he is thriving. He is eating. But that time jumping right into Zamba. He still has that double jump on oh. deck. He wants to be so conservative with it now that the pressure is on. Oh, wait, wait. The anti air is coming out the jabs and now trying to catch the landing yet again. That didn't connect. Oh, man. Zamba playing for this grand finals ticket. Wait. Wait. Oh. I'm, I'm waiting, but nothing has happened quite yet. Swagas with a couple of really well placed eggs oh, has the no right way. idea with the tech roll in. Uh oh. So much damage coming out from both players. The backer might find its mark very soon. Wait. Oh my goodness, man. <gasps> Game three, last hit. Losers finals. Oh, this is How so is he brutal. Find his way off the ledge and catches him double jumping back on. And just like that, oh. Zamba going to be making his way back into uh, the finals, this time, Grand Finals. What a set wow. and what a run that was. We saw, like, what is that, four back-to-back -back Suarez sets putting on a show through so many characters and just his run ending right there at third place. But what a situation catching there, the ledge trap scenario with the up air. <laughs> Enhance! And, uh, yeah. yeah, there it is. So... I think there was a lot of pressure on both players. We definitely saw both of them dropping just a couple of things here and there. One thing that should have definitely led to Suarez's game, he was in a position where he could cover roll in. He did cover roll in. He short hopped, he forwarded, and then it didn't connect because he drifted in a little bit too far forward. So if he did like jump and C-stick in place with forwarded and ended up moving a little bit too far to the side, I'd have been a little bit upset, but he needed to have moved back with it to actually be able to get that grounded spike, which would have been able to follow up into an uphill. And just because Suarez didn't find that, he had it. He reacted to it. He was waiting for it. And then was just that close to not being able to connect it. He lost his stock at the end instead of Zamba.